Hello guys, uh, welcome back to Malik Jaw 34 channel. This is Malik Arjun. Again, this is going to be continuation series of my ASM course where uh, we have seen a lot of things in ASM uh, starting with the introduction, you know, and then, uh, you know, software stack, mirroring, striping, and what are the benefits, advantages, and uh, ASM tool, and then dynamic rebalancing. Also, we are checked with the ASM architecture and then, you know, uh, the base components and instance Oracle DB instance versus Oracle ASM instance, you know, and what is special about ASM and then on uh, Oracle uh, ASM supports for multiple versions of database and the basic components of disk group, disk KU and ASM files, you know, and then allocation, everything we have seen it and the extent map and, you know, uh, allocation unit and failure groups and then, you know, redundancy, external redundancy, high redundancy, normal redundancy and, you know, uh, creating a disk group, everything, you know, we have uh, seen in, in my previous sessions and also uh, we have gone through a live lab demonstration about how you can administrate your ASM, you know, all these commands we have manually uh, executed in my lab environment and you know we have seen all this k word k fed you know uh, all this uh, exercise we have completed yesterday and then today uh, is going to be one of the interesting topic that is uh, moving your data uh, files between the disk groups okay so before i start with the today's session if you are new to my channel always go back to youtube and search for malik 034 and then please do subscribe if you like my videos please share like and comment and if you missed out my previous videos you can always refer it in my youtube channel malik 034 and let's start with the today's session so you can use alter database data file uh, you know data file name you know offline and then copy the data file to the uh, new disk group you can use either dbms file transfer or rman or xdp ftp client and this is a particular mass document talks more about uh, how you can move your data file between the disk groups and then you know alter database rename that uh, file to uh, the old file to new file and recover that new file name and then alter database uh, data file new file online and then you can drop that old file these are the typically uh, five to six uh, steps you can do it uh, you can move your uh, files from one disk group to other disk group so if i can check here okay uh, the 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 frequently asked question right uh, the transportable table space with ASM. Does ASM work with the transportable table space? Yes, of course it will work. ASM works with the transportable table space. You can use a PLSQL package DBMS file transfer to copy data files from ASM disk group to another disk group even on another host. Uh, till 10 gr 2 you can only uh, copy ASM to ASM or OS to OS. DBMS file transfer cannot copy data file in the operating system file into ASM disk group. You can use RMAN to backup and recreate a table space in the new database even if one one is even is one and OS file to another ASM. Like you know normal traditional RDBMS to ASM you can use it uh, all this uh, file transfer method. So I can quickly go to this particular mass document I already opened here. So what this more particular mass document talks about if you see it has a typically nine steps. First one like identify the data file to be moved. Uh, if you can see here, uh, select name and uh, file name from db underscore files. Uh, you know, if you observe these all files are in my ASM disk group one, and this particular user file is in ASM disk group two. And then here in this MOS document, they are moving uh, this particular file from disk group two to disk group one. What they are doing it? They are just checking what are the disk groups are available, disk group one and disk group two. And then what they are doing this uh, disk from disk group two, this particular file they are bringing offline and they'll copy this particular file from disk group 2 to disk group 1 either dbms file transfer or rmn like dbms file transfer you have to create a directory and you have to uh, you know create a replace directory you have to create a directory if one is on disk group 1 and one is on disk group 2 and then you have to use dbms file transfer package copy file and they're they're transferring from one location to other location or you can use rmn copy command like uh, connect to our main and use copy data file from disk group 2 to disk group 1 and once you copy it and you know the rename the data file alter database rename uh, this particular disk group 2 file I'm renaming it to disk group 1 file and then once you uh, do the rename uh, you know you can use this particular command recover data file and then that disk group name one and then the file name and then you can bring it online uh, alter database data file and that 
file which is in this group one and then make it online and later you know you can verify it all the files are you know uh, pointing to this group one and then you can uh, drop the old uh, old this old file alter this group this group to drop that file name so these files are steady freight forward and you know simple okay so uh, i have created the same steps uh, here uh, similar to this particular document mouse document so what we can do we will execute in my lab uh, machine and then we'll see it how it goes so i'll just uh, run this particular command so i will connect to database and then run this one okay this group two and okay what about the file name i need a file name right okay here it is i will run this one okay so i have user file here and i have data and record two disk groups Everything, all the files are in data and then i will move this user file to my record disk group so for that alter database data file user offline user sunless media record is enabled okay my database is not in uh, rk log mode so we will shut it down and then we will bring my database into our catalog mode okay startup mount okay database mounted alter database archive log okay database in archive log mode alter database open okay database is opened so we'll fire the same command okay database altered the file become offline now so connect to our main and then uh, you know uh, copy data file from data disk group that user file to record disk group so i will connect to my armen target slash okay connected to dev db and then i will do copy data file to record disk group you can see starting backup okay done and then this is my file name right so i'll just take this file name and then you know i will keep it here alter database rename file from data disk group to record disk group right so now i'll copy this particular command i'll go to sql prompt and then i'll fire this particular alter database rename file old file to new file right database altered and now recover data file i will give that new file name recover data file and then the data file name and then i will do this recover data file media recovery completed right so now alter database data file and i'll give new file online Rico, okay uh, keyword online resize drop or extend okay so there's a typo here so command is wrong you can see record data file so what i'll do i'll go back i'll just copy this particular the new file name i'll just paste it here okay now the command is perfect so i'll just copy this one okay again the typo here copy control c alter database data file new file name online database altered that's perfect and then now you can do list files you can see that user data file is pointed to record disk group so you can this this is a way you can move your file from one disk group to other disk group let's go to the next slide 
uh, ASM disk string uh, already we covered about lot about ASM disk string ASM disk string uh, a pattern matching uh, string specifying the disk to be discovered like dev oracle ASM disks whatever the disks in this particular location everything will be discovered or you can give dev raw raw disk 2 to 9 the raw disk which uh, ending with this number 2 to 9 will be discovered and other than this will be discarded uh, asm can use a different disk string in parallel you can you can give uh, uh, asm underscore disk string and then you can give multiple pattern uh, asm can use a different types of storage in parallel like raw nfs and asm library anything you can give it and if you can see here asm underscore disk string disk string pattern all disk accessed by asm must match one of the disk discovery string in your asm disk string like you can give asm underscore disk string and string one string two string three string four string five whatever it is you can give a number of string definitions here for example os specific defaults are like dev ra ra star on linux and orcl colon volume star on linux asm library dev r disk star on solarize dev r disk star on hp dev uh, rh disk slash star on x and windows it will be slash slash dot slash you know orcl disk star on windows uh, you know these are different uh, disk pattern you can you can uh, give it in your asm disk string all will be you know discoverable and you know uh, to wide open disk string will cause asm to scan unnecessarily like you know if you have uh, like thousands of disk in your dev raw and if you give like this you know if you have like dev raw raw star like if you are assuming you have thousands of disk you know asm will take a lot of time to scan all the disks so rather than that you know you can specify dev raw raw like 1 to 30 and dev raw raw like 32 to 34 these are my asm disk used for oracle i can specify this uh, this kind you know other than this you know everything will be like uh, this 31 and then you know um, uh, other than this 34 like 35 36 everything will be excluded you can you can give like you know whatever disk string you you uh, it is suitable for your asm this is about asm disk string and then how you can manage and then you know common discovery problems right uh, disk string does not match vara 15031 and disk string to complex wrong device ownership wrong device type wrong device binding disk uh, disks are partitioned incorrectly os header mismatch so these are like common uh, issues whenever you are working with your uh, you know when you are bringing your asm uh, you, these are the similar uh, common problem you will uh, you will face it what are 15031 disk specification percentages matches no disk ownership of a raw device can change to root after the reboot exclude disk from discovery like you can exclude right so already covered in previous slide right so all this you know uh, one of the uh, uh, best practice or troubleshooting tips you can use it when you are working with asm or rack for example disk string does not match like asm disk string if you are giving draw dev raw raw like 2 to 9 alter disk group add disk dev raw raw 0 so it is says that not all alternations you know uh, disk specification raw zero matches no disks and then you can see your asm disk string will get to know that is excluded in my disk discovery string so then you can change it to uh, zero to nine or you know raw star like these are just a just example i would like to give it here so whenever you are working with uh, uh, you know uh, asm you will you'll, you'll, you'll find it will found out these kind of uh, common uh, issues or mistakes so with this uh, you know i would like to uh, uh, conclude this asm course and uh, you know i'm planning to come up with a few more uh, lab sessions and then i will be uh, attaching it to my uh, you know asm course okay so if you go to youtube and search for malik 034 and uh, uh, i have created a separate uh, you know uh, asm uh, playlist if you go here at the down and created playlist you can see asm playlist here and you can click on that asm playlist you will see all the whatever the hello everyone for welcome I to covered. malik 
and uh, all this course you will find it out here and uh, you know i will come up with a few more lab sessions on particularly for the csm and asm administration i am going to upload it everything in this csm course you can follow this particular playlist and you can follow in this order whatever order i have kept it here and you know it will be easy for you guys to understand uh, thank you guys i will come up with a new uh, lab sessions uh, and then i'll i'll be uploading it to uh, same asm playlist thank you